Obviously, you came out last week. You guys, you know, were on this very field making a statement. Uh, what did what did today mean to have the fans come back and kind of support you in the same way? You know, I mean, we made that statement not only because it was the right thing to do, but because it's what we wanted to do. And we we knew we had support, but then you come out here for something like this today, at six in the morning, and there's people lined up everywhere, and it's just, it just, you know, you just can do nothing but appreciate it and you know you fall in love with you know everybody that you're playing for and all these people mean so much to the university that you know you just you feel like you you have an obligation to, to play for them and to, you know to get, let everything out there for for them so you know we're just right now we're just kind of itching ready to get on the field on Saturdays because it's going to be an awesome year. With with the way that the transfer rules are set up it seems like this is particularly important for some of the younger players, some of the freshmen and sophomores. Can you just kind of speak to that? Yeah, well, I mean, the rules came out at a bad time for the younger guys because they just got here. So, they, and not only as freshmen, but just they literally just got here two weeks before right. it all came out. So they don't, they haven't really experienced the, the real Penn State thing yet. You know, they've just been working out. So for them to see something like this, you know, see all the support just for a, a half hour, 45 minute workout, it's, it's kind of mind blowing for them and rightfully so because I mean where else do you get something like this right. so it just kind of gave them a taste of what the stadium's like what the fans are like and that's you know, a big deal for them because now that I mean they're probably they're probably drooling over the fact that it's Saturdays in that stadium so you know I can't thank the fans enough for showing their support helping us out that way and and just for with everything else did, did you know or did you have a sense that, that you would get this kind of reaction after you know everything that had happened people were pretty obviously bummed out uh, right. you know to well, say the least. <laughs> yeah, I mean, everybody was bummed out. But, you know, it take a couple of days to recover and just kind of think things through. But um, we, we knew we were going to have this kind of reaction, but we didn't know how it was going to be this big. You know what I mean? I mean, you, you can't, you can't you. imagine you. Something, some, so many people coming for a workout, like I said. And, and it's just you, you can't do anything to plan for that. You know, you just show up and you're just kind of jaw drops and you're just – you're just in awe of like oh, the love and the, the fans and you know the support and just the pride and where and where you come from. And, you know, just you can do nothing but thank them and, and you know just go out and play for them. You looking forward to September first? I can't wait, man. Cool.